Hey, what's up? This week on Rock Peaks, we've got The Walkman, Iron and Wine, Motorhead, Prince, and Herbie Hancock and the Headhunters. that wraparound mic technique. You know, we can see why the Walkman chose their song Juveniles for their big network TV appearance. It's a well-crafted, catchy rock song, but it sure isn't the best thing on their fantastic new album, Lisbon. That honor, my friends, goes to the propulsive and euphoric Angela Surf City, an absolutely killer track that makes good on the band's frequent comparisons to fellow New York rockers, The Strokes. <laughs> on Wanda Bad Girl Jackson's collaboration with Jack White back in episode 23. This month, the pair have been making the late night rounds, playing selections from The Party Ain't Over, like this old Johnny Kidd and the Pirates number, which is probably one of the most covered songs in rock. Anyway, what we'd really like to see next is their take on Dylan's Thunder on the Mountain. That's when I get chills all Halfway working on a worn out house And all our friends, the ragged crows And they can Why now? Mm, the trademark falsetto strains The lush musical instrumentation The groovy doo-wop vocal accompaniment Samuel Beam's fourth full-length disc Continues to build on the sonic palette that he laid down on 2007's The Shepherd's Dog This new album came out on Tuesday and already is averaging eight or nine stars out of ten on most of the major music review sites. Okay. After you get over your shock that we just segued from achingly beautiful flannel rock into bone-crunching speed metal, just consider it an inoculation against the coming onslaught of all things Lemmy, starting with the release of a new Motorhead album called The World Is Yours. Probably of more interest to fans of the legendary British power trio is the release next month of the long-awaited doc about the mutton shop frontman, entitled simply Lemmy, 49% motherfucker, 51% son of a bitch. Now that's not exactly a family-friendly title, but early reports in the film suggest that Lemmy's idea of a fun night these days is racking up the high score on the trivia machine at the local bar around the corner from his house in L.A. This past week marks the anniversary of Prince's television debut on Dick Clark's American Bandstand, which was sadly a lip-sync affair, but one that his purpleness artfully overcame with an impressive array of spins, crotch grabs, and other assorted hot dance moves. It's Super Bowl Sunday next weekend, and if the Black Eyed Peas are hoping to rival any recent halftime performance, you can bet they're looking to Prince's stunning 2007 turn on the stage in Miami, when, you'll remember, he actually performed Purple Rain in the rain. Good 
job down in the city Working for the man in the night and day Never get a lost one minute of sleep Well, it's not the way you think Might not get fish Big wheel keep on turning Outside in the cold distance A wildcat did ground one of the more curious selections in the 12-minute medley was the cover of the Foo Fighters' Best of You. Now I say curious because the Foo's actually once covered one of Prince's songs, Darling Nikki, much to his displeasure. But if this retaliatory cover was meant to rankle the members of the Foo Fighters, the strategy failed. Taylor Hawkins said later that the band loved his version of their song, admitting that he did it better than they ever did. The biggest news in music video trading circles this past week was the arrival of a long-lost TV concert by Herbie Hancock and the Headhunters, originally recorded on German TV in 1974 and recently rebroadcast digitally on Japanese television. Herbie Hancock's massive 1973 record, Headhunters, remains the high watermark of that genre known as jazz fusion. It was a huge crossover hit. While the record is devoid of guitars, it's rich in other sounds, like that of the clavinet, and heavily influenced by African percussive rhythms. Enjoy this laid-back groove. I'm Barnaby Marshall. Hope you'll come back next week for another episode of Rock Peaks.